Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all well. My name is Talia, I come from Greece and today I'm back with another reaction video. One of my favorite girl groups, Mama Moo, is back with a brand new title track titled Where Are We Now? The girls are back with their 11th mini album and from what we saw from the teasers it is probably going to be an emotional balance song which kind of travels us to their years as a group together since the beginning until now. I was pretty excited for this release and in fact I realized that I haven't reacted to a girl group until now on my channel so I wouldn't miss this chance. Before we start, let me remind you that if you're new here, you can subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell to stay tuned for all the new videos. I'm grateful that you ended up here and I hope that you'll stay. Now let's not waste any more time and watch the music video. The aesthetics of this video These landscapes, the whole atmosphere is amazing
their smile just light up the whole space. And this piano, it's all touching. Okay, I managed not to cry, but I really wanted to. I want to say I'm speechless. <laughs> I think we needed a balance song by them. It's been a long time since they made a similar song. And I believe uh, it talks exactly about themselves. It's kind of like they talk to each other, like they're referring to one another and are reminiscing about their first meeting in the beginning and how everything was back then when they started as a group. As I said, I really loved the music. I find it very aesthetic. It is kind of sorrowful and sad, but at the same time calm. It relaxes you, it is mysterious. Even without the lyrics and without the video, just the music brings calmness in your mind and travels you to a forest, to a sea, somewhere quiet and peaceful. About the lyrics, I think that they exactly talk about their years together as a group, that they are actually talking to each other, that they are referring to one another. They are talking about how grateful they are for all the moments they have spent together, how wonderful it was that they found one another, and that they had a common dream which they actually made true all together through the years and that somehow they will always remember how they were when they first met that they feel nostalgic about these days it even feels like a way to express their love towards each other however what makes the song sad is this uncertainty about what is going to happen in the future. They keep expressing doubts and concern about their future as a group, probably, and what is going to happen if one day they're not together anymore. For example, a lyric that really stayed with me is the lyric, where's the end? Do we even have an end? Because we all know that for K-pop groups, there comes a time that the members they have to take several ways. Let's hope that this won't happen with Mamamoo soon. But this is the vibe that I got. And now some things about the video. It was so amazing. Totally matches my aesthetic. So calm, beautiful sceneries, nature all around. And we got many different aspects of nature. For example, of the forest. We had the parts during the daylight, where they seemed more carefree and peaceful and the other parts in the woods, but it was night and to be honest, in these clips they reminded me of witches, but not in a bad sense Do you know in tales that we read about the ceremonies witches made in the forests during the night, mainly under the full moon? and they were wearing all white or the other part with the lights that they were inside a circle this reminded me of tales I have read about fairies and how people used to make circles with candles to call fairies so that's why it gave me a mysterious vibe as well of course I especially loved the final clip that they were all together on the van, having fun, laughing, smiling. It was probably the best part of the music video. I hope that you loved it too and I can't wait to hear your opinion down in the comments. I have heard about many things, I have read many things on Twitter about the girls and I actually don't want to believe anything because there is no official statement by the company or the girls themselves so we don't know anything the only thing we know is that they are mamamoo they are four they are here and most importantly they are back 
with an amazing song. They deserve much love and attention and then we're all here to support them once again. One personal story is that Mama Moo were actually the first group that I felt really connected to. The first group that I really loved and admired even more. They were the second group that I stand, but since the first song I listened to, I felt really connected to them. I'm amazed by their every work and I get really emotional. I just love them and I'll keep doing so no matter what. So that was all. I hope that you enjoyed today's video and that you had fun here. If you liked my video, you can give it a like, share it around with your friends and of course subscribe to my channel for more relevant content. See you next time. Bye-bye!